Hello guys, and today I'm going to eat an out-of-date chocolate bar, which is called a Cadbury sandwich snack. Now why they've called a chocolate bar a sandwich snack, I've no idea, because normally people associate sandwiches with bread. Now this is out of date, and the expiry date, or the best before date I should say, is the 15th of February 2024. It's currently the 22nd of June 2024. There's going to be a general election on the 4th of July. Yes, the infamous 4th of July when America celebrates independence. I couldn't possibly have known that back then. Um, it's common knowledge, so I'm not going to provide a news report because there's so many of them. Also today, there was a news report about um, Taylor Swift um, I'll find it in a minute. Anyway, I'll come back to it, right? But there was a news report about Taylor about um, Taylor Swift doing a selfie with um, the Royals, okay? And I'll find that in a minute. I did have it, but yeah, I got it. And it says, Taylor Swift grabs Royal Selfie at London gig. And it shows you a photograph of Prince William and his children with Taylor Swift. I couldn't possibly have known that. Um... You know, way back in February. So, now, I'm going to open it. I need to, I've never tried these before, so I've no idea what to expect, okay? Now, as I said, it is the 22nd of June today, okay? Inside, you've got one, one, two, three, four, five... So we've got six, oh, I didn't even need to count them, it says six on there. And it says, be treat wise, whatever that means. And, again, it's got snack sandwich. So this is one of the bars. I've never tried these before, as I said. Um, often with some of them, it, it says milk chocolate sandwich biscuit. So, I know it might look, be a bourbon. I'm not a biggest fan of bourbons, to be completely honest with you. But there you go. Um, and open it up. Inside, it's not what I thought. It looks almost like um, a club. You might think, what am I talking about? We have these um, chocolates here called um, clubs, and they look fairly similar to this, where there's a biscuit inside, and it's got completely covered on the outside with chocolate like this. Not what I was expecting. Break it in half, see what happens. Maybe there's two inside. Right, okay. And this is why they're calling it a sandwich. Inside, you can see there's some biscuits, followed by... Um, chocolate followed by biscuits and I've covered the whole um, thing with chocolate so often with a lot of these you get um, biscuit inside and then it's just covered in chocolate and they've done chocolate biscuit chocolate biscuits that's why they're calling it a sandwich okay it seems like a wafer I'm not sure it is a wafer, but it seems like it. I 
And Carl just said, does it totally fairly because it's this out of date, but it seems rather similar to a Kit Kat, to be honest. Um, there's a lot of waffle about what it contains, and they say it contains milk chocolate, sandwich biscuits. They call it a milk chocolate sandwich biscuit, and they say it consists of sugar, wheat, flour, milk, vegetable fats, cocoa butter, cocoa mass, dextrose, fat reduced cocoa powder, invert sugar syrup. I'll have to find out what this invert sugar syrup is sometime. I mean, how can you invert sugar or syrup? I've no idea. Um, emulsifiers. Flavorings and it says it may contain nuts. And, and what I mean is it shouldn't do, but it might in the factory, and that's for people with a nut allergy. Okay, so I'm saying, although it's not supposed to contain nuts, it's probably made in a factory where they do use nuts, and so they put this warning on. Just in case for people. Mm. I'm probably something to a Kit Kat if I'm honest. I could be wrong, but I'm not very really sure. Um to be honest, this wasn't what I was expecting at all because I thought it'd be like a board bond where they have like a Biscuit, then chop it in the middle or something, and then biscuit. Yeah, that's what I thought we were going to do, but no. Mm. The main difference, as I said, I've never kicked out of many of it, it's just. Biscuit inside covered with chocolate and then put a bit a layer of chocolate in the middle as well But I don't think it makes that much of a difference. I think it's just a gimmick to be honest um, I can't find the real difference between this and a Kit Kat or something similar so Does it taste okay? Yes, I think it tastes a bit sickly to be honest, but I'm not sure if that's because the um, chocolate is four months out of date, to be fair. Um, you know? So, but... Or maybe it's just me, I have no idea. But, anyway guys, um... I just a happy sandwich, and they themselves have given their own sort of strange review here by saying, I don't know if you can see this, but they put on, um, it's lovely. Quite while they're blowing their own trumpet and bragging about how good one of their own chocolates is, I've no idea, but there you go. This is just, um, chocolate by itself, and it says milk chocolate sandwich biscuit on the individual wrappers. And here, obviously, like many here, you can just lift that down and see something else. That's just if you don't like it. I'm just saying, if you don't like it, you can send it back and, well, you'll probably get your money back or a voucher or something. Um, I mean, they say not completely satisfied, but I'm sure there has to be something wrong with it. Um, I doubt you just say, I just didn't like it, can I have my money back? You know, if there's nothing wrong with it. Um, and there, of course, is the um, best before date of the 15th of 
February 24, okay? 24. So there you go, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.